Classic TV fans, Frick 9 g here. Welcome to my first video for my second annual Christmas special. I'm so happy to be able to cover TV shows and movies, classic ones that is, in which we'll look at really cool, fun, exciting things, trivia, bloopers, really cool factoids that I think you will absolutely love celebrating the Christmas season. Don't forget, so you don't miss any of these videos, to hit that red subscribe button if you haven't done so yet to subscribe to the channel and to support it. We're gonna be talking about the I Love Lucy Christmas show in this video. Now, it was one of the episodes of I Love Lucy that is not well known to even big fans. Now, it's the 27th episode of season six, almost at the end of the running of I Love Lucy. The director was James V. Kern, and it originally aired Christmas Eve, December 24th, 1956. Now, if we look at the episode itself, we see Ricky, Fred, Lucy, and Ethel they began to reminisce and remember through some flashbacks, um, one could say their favorite moments of I Love Lucy as they're trimming a tree on Christmas Eve. Now, a little bit of a note here, CBS would rebroadcast this episode in prime time on December 18th, 1989. Now, the segments, the non-flashback parts, they were broadcast in color in 1990, and these color scenes are available today. You can purchase them widely pretty much anywhere where they sell this episode, DVD or in Blu-ray format as well. Because this was a special episode, it was never read broadcast in syndication, and we'll talk about what made it special. Now, since the Ricardos and the Mertzes were spending Christmas Eve together, they had problems with their Christmas tree. There were some issues with Fred trimming the branches a little too much, and by the end, there was almost no Christmas tree left. Now, the four of them were reminiscing about how lucky they were to have little Ricky with them. Why? Well, they thought of the memories surrounding his birth. Now, on Christmas morning, Lucy, Ricky, Ethel, and Fred, they all dressed like Santa Claus to surprise little Ricky. But they soon find out that there is a fifth Santa Claus, played by, well, if you know the actor A. Cameron Grant, he quickly disappears and he turns out to be the real Santa Claus. Now, believe it or not, this is the first ever clip show or flashback show ever on television before. Yep, before this, there was never really the thought of a flashback episode. I mean, that's due to the genius people on I Love Lucy and their idea to broadcast some of the moments seen before in three other previous episodes. Now in this one, Little Ricky gets a new bike. He also gets a new set of drums and a train set for Christmas. I mean, they splurged on that kid. Now the flashback episodes were taken from the episode 50, 52, and 56. Now, if you think about the Santa scene at the end of the episode, that was taken from a little segment called Jingle Bells in a scene that originally aired in the season one episode after Drafted. Now, the only difference between that scene and this one was that in that one, Vernon Dent played Santa Claus, and it was done in the first apartment versus the second apartment. But other than that, it was fairly pretty much the same. And that little Ricky was in this one, so they're referring to him in this one. Now, the reason that this episode wasn't put into the other 179 bulk of episodes is because CBS didn't think that anybody would want to watch a Christmas theme episode at any time of the year besides the holiday season. So if you would turn to I Love Lucy in reruns in July, if you saw a Christmas episode, CBS thought no one wants to watch this. So they pulled it out of the 180, leaving 179 episodes, and it was pretty much lost for decades until they began to air it in the 1980s and then later now you can pretty much watch it anytime you want if you pick up the dvds and so forth now the flashback plot is a way to show people clips from the very popular pregnancy episodes which hadn't been seen on tv since they aired originally so i hope this was really interesting for you my thing or my inquiry here is to find out how many of you have seen this christmas episode because from what i know many of you haven't it's great to be able to bring you scenes from it as well as scenes from the flashback and in color let me know what you think about it in color 
Do you like it like this or would you prefer to see it in black and white? I don't think there's a right or wrong answer here. I do have my preference though. I won't reveal it. I'll wait for all of you to tell me which one you prefer. Thanks for all the comments. Thanks for all the support. Sit back, relax. More Christmas videos, Christmas theme videos will be out very, very soon. We'll see you all next time and don't forget to always stay positive and most importantly, be hopeful. Thank you so much to my supporters, especially my Diamond Tier patrons. Vito L, Sally N, Ricky, Kevin K, Gerard D, David D, and Citizen Kane 359. If you want your name to be heard or put on this list, make sure to check out the patron link in the description. Thank you so much.